So, 2020, the files were out that they were untested and so on and so on. People still chose to take them, not sure why. But anyway, along with these, not just people we know around us, family who've died and had instant reactions of heart attacks. Just stranger, literally everyone we know is affected by these, ourselves, anyone we speak to, the same, and so on. But how come? How come all the world's morticians are now coming out on doctors speaking against these? But again, nanotech, mRNA and more are not good for your body. We're natural, bio-living things. You start messing with things, things start going wrong. There's so many issues with this. You can go into fetal cells like MRC5, the hex cells, never mind them added chemicals. Would you ever drink bleach? But you won't. No one will drink bleach unless you know you want to die, but you put bleach in your jabs. In the USA, children have 70 jabs or something now. Autism rates are what? Health rates are what? Why are humans getting worse, but everything's better? Not just that. Food, tap water, everything is chemicalised. Everything's GMO to synthetic. Natural eats everything. There's a Twitter page for people to go look into, but don't just go by that. Always do a lot deeper research. You can't just go by the basic things pushed on Google or whatever, DuckDuckGo or any other thing you use. It takes a lot more than just the things pushed in your face. A lot of things are blocked, a lot of good people are blocked and so on and so on and so on. Like, how much more things will happen? <laughs> like, it's comical. I get people want it to be a, a, a test subject, I'm not sure why. Just, it's worse when you find out the, the the Rona has still never been isolated and stuff, so... Hmm... The flu radically went away, terrorism radically went away, but then all of a sudden it's all come back suddenly. Question things. 